Dominic Agu's uncle was killed and his home destroyed when his village, Orkpen in Benwe State, was attacked by herdsmen. His community, the Tith ethnic group, say there were attacks for defending their farmland from Fulani herdsmen who want to use it to graze cattle. We saw some gunmen just entered, started killing our people with guns. The next option we should take, we had nothing to defend ourselves than to run outside the, the village. Farmers say many villages like Orkpen have been destroyed by the herdsmen in similar attacks over the last few weeks. The state government says at least 20 farmers have been killed and tens of thousands of people displaced during the violence. But herdsmen like Mohammed Husseini blame the farmers for the fighting. He says they've stolen and killed thousands of cows for meat and that some herdsmen have been killed too. Basically, whether you like it or not, most of the cattle routes were blocked by farmers. Instead of them to allow the, the road, the road passage for the cattle, they block it. There is fierce competition for land here, which is fertile, whereas up north, where most of the herdsmen come from, there's drought and desertification. People here say one solution to stopping the violence is to create more grazing reserves for herdsmen. But until then, there might be more violence like this as the competition for land continues. Ivan Dege, Al Jazeera, Benway State.